Hi Leos, welcome to my channel. So today we are going to do your weekly reading. You versus them from 19th till 25th of October and we will see what are the guidance messages for you in the coming week. Alright, so for those who are new to my channel, a warm welcome to you all. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please consider subscribing and hit the bell notification icon as well so that you will be able to get updated about my latest videos. Okay, so... And this is a general reading. It might or might not resonate with all of you. Okay, so let's see what is there for my Leos. Four of Swords just popped out. So I'm really getting that you're sleeping a lot, Leos. Not ready for a big workout. Okay, resting, calm, peace is important. Because you are tired, I guess. Nine of Swords, feeling tired, feeling stressed. That is why you are taking some nap. You are taking a pause, I'm saying. Let's see what do we have for my Leos in this week. What is happening? Hmm. Eight of Cups. Moving away from something which was not serving you right. I'm seeing. Okay. One more shuffle. So at the back of the deck we have five of cups and the seven of pentacles so it's it's more your energy over here leos it's like you are done with something you are not ready for somebody still you are feeling about your past still you are thinking i'm getting that you are thinking about the past that you were not given the justice which you actually needed you you have lost those energies which you always had in you okay so enthusiastic kind of energy you are tired from some kind of a relationship i'm really getting that you are tired from this person or this relationship it's like it's not serving you right and that is why you are like you are sad you are feeling bad and you are crying i can hear it leos okay it is actually it is really stressful for you right now it is and i am seeing this okay so from inside you are like from inside and outside i'm getting that your energies are similar from inside also you are broken from outside also you are broken you are not in the same place in which you were in august i guess your uh your birthday month okay july or august so i'm really seeing your energies are shifted leos your energies are more about uh, sadness over here you know you are leaving some kind of a relationship it was a good relationship you are leaving that relationship and you are moving forward in your life because something happened okay the person with whom you were dealing with is like you know ego problems ego clashes plus might be a fire sign as well just like you leo sag aries or yeah aries over here i have um sag leo aries again so a lot of energies like similar energies you had and that is why the the clashes were there that is why the the um ego clashes the things were not similar okay when you are ready to fight your person is also ready to fight okay nobody had patience nobody had had patience to listen to the other person's perspective as well over here so that is why you are silent your person is silent you both are in a non-talking zone i'm seeing they are also not talking they are also just giving themselves time so that they can grow within themselves okay they are more into themselves right now and you felt that you were not given the justice which you actually deserved and your person was like okay i am myself i am this i am that so i'm really getting i me and myself over here not from you from your person you were like how can i be with this person like forever okay so you have to think other person's need as well and that person of yours is was not not listening to you was not feeling the same with you okay so yeah the change is here with them okay the wheel of fortune with the knight of wands i'm seeing that 
the change is drastic you know you were somebody who was always like happy go lucky kind of a person and the change is drifted because of this person's you know uh, aura change so that is why when you saw that change in your person when you saw that total rift of energies you you felt that who is this person because he is just he or she is just talking about my himself or herself they are more interested in their growth and what about our relationship what about the growth in our relationship no they are not seeing that and that is why you felt sad you felt sorry and you felt that like leaving from the situation which you are already doing the eight of cups is here okay your future energies three of swords with the queen of swords libran energy october season it is and i'm really getting that it is like a peak season a peak month for you leo it's like a breakup is happening somebody is like so much rigid in this so much stubborn that they are not even ready like they are not even listening to you they are not even uh, like you're crying and they are like okay cry i don't even care about you whatever you are feeling i don't care about you okay so really this is what is happening so the advice for you leos is the moon with the hanged man two major arcanas it means that advice is also very major it is not a minor advice it is like take a pause now okay leos take some pause you are not ready for anything you are not ready for a relationship yet you are not ready for something to entertain anyone else it's for it's your time to to just take some time for yourself go on a vacation go and do something like go and just like do cooking okay so do something which actually helps you which actually makes you soothing feel soothe, soothing and do whatever you want to do okay try not to involve in the person's life okay so this is what the advice is coming from the tarot what else do we have the chariot move on in life leos okay so this is cancer energy just bounce back the energies okay just bounce back that person go towards something i'm getting seven number i'm also getting that okay so if you are involved in some kind of occult and numerology or some kind of tarot reading so just move towards that if you are getting that feeling to enter into this field go towards it if you are getting uh, in your intuitions are also with the seven number i'm also getting that uh, just go into your intuitions and move ahead in life okay nine of swords stop crying and move on leos it's not your energy you are not meant to cry leos okay eight of wands see you are ready for that fiery energy to show the people that you are the talk of the town leos you know that they are just the perfect they are just wow when they enter the room it's like it's sparkling leos okay so stop holding on from the person just move on get that person do whatever the person he or she wants stop crying leos really i'm not i don't want you to just you know cry cry and see your energy i was just thinking about queen of wands and it just appeared so this is your energy leos so this is you see how beautiful you see well diwali is coming and we are having the candles over here so it's time so diwali can be a very beautiful season for those who are in india so uh, a very beautiful message for you something is coming towards you in diwali just get ready to get a new opportunity might be a job opportunity something is coming towards you something someone is going to offer you because i'm getting two offers see ace of pentacles with the six of pentacles somebody who is very gentle who is a genuine person will come towards you and they would offer you something okay might be regarding uh money might be regarding love it can be anything okay leos so that is all from my side leos okay what do we have what signs do we have aries cancer libra capricorn leos uh, pisces pisces and what else cancer pisces hmm 
okay libra again so that's all we have over here okay so that is all from my side leos i hope it helps and we will meet you in the next video till then bye